We started the day with six trucks ready to load sheep and head to the winter range. But before we could get all the trucks loaded, we found out almost a third of the herd was missing. There's a lot that goes into getting all the sheep to the winter ranges at the end of fall, and it's pretty rare that everything works out the way we plan. It's always amazing to me how fast the fall passes by, and winter sneaks right on up on us. It seems like we just get sheep where they need to be and we're on the move again. Our sheep spend the time in preparation for winter in fields and pastures. Luckily, most of them are relatively close to the ranch. The night before we were supposed to head to the desert, we gathered the sheep and headed them to the corral where they would spend the night and be loaded onto trucks first thing in the morning. Got all the trucks fired up this morning. Nice and toasty inside the shop. I'm gonna go get all the trailers hooked up, ready to go head to the desert. When it's so cold outside, we're sure glad to be able to park the trucks inside and keep them warm. It makes it a lot easier on them to start warm before we have to haul. Seven degrees. It's kind of cold out here. With all the trucks hooked up, fueled up, ready to roll, we headed across the road to get this herd loaded up and headed to the desert. Even in the snow and the cold, the sheep know where they're going and they're ready to get there. We're able to load out of our corral at home pretty quick and in no time at all, we had three trucks loaded and ready to go. After we got the fourth truck loaded, we started looking through the corral and even though we were supposed to be loading six trucks, there most definitely wasn't enough sheep to fill that many, so something wasn't adding up. Well, we're two trucks short worth of sheep. They've disappeared on us, so we gotta go out and go find them. Been a nice cold day looking for these sheep. Flew the drone all over the place, couldn't find them. Drove all over the place in the snow, but uh, after a lot of searching, picked them up with the drone, found them, pushed them down to the corner with the old flyer. Now we uh, gotta go mob the commander and the dogs over there, see if we can get them pushed out. Gathered up, headed down the road and where they need to go for the day. It got wild. Tried to escape three different times. It's a good thing old Jake ready to work. Bring him down, get him in this field, go ahead and get around him with the old side by side, push him out on the road, get him where they need to be today. Good boy. Good boy. Good dogs. Good dogs. Down. Now, I only got a mile walk back to this side by side through the snow not too bad thank goodness for four-wheel drive and good dogs because of them i was able to get the sheep out of the pasture through several different gates and headed for home Thanks, Mark. Another beautiful day out here. Gonna get this truck hooked up, fueled up, ready to go, go across the road and load these other sheep and get the last ones to the desert. With all the sheep accounted for, we hooked up trucks again and headed over to load them and get on the road.
because of the odd number of sheep we ended up with, and in order to get everything to fit, we had to haul a few in the horse trailer. With all these rogue sheep rounded up and loaded on the trucks, we put on the driving shoes and headed down the road. It's always a good feeling to have the last of the sheep on the winter range, and the herder was pretty glad to see the rest of his sheep show up. Now that we have all the sheep unloaded and the chute strapped on the truck, it was on to what I like to call a crappy job. It's a beautiful summer's day out here on the desert. Just finished hauling sheep, got all the sheep off the trucks. Now we gotta get this trailer nice and cleaned out and ready to go. We can haul lambs to California next week, so let's get scraping. We usually spray out our trailers with a fire hose. It's much faster, but without irrigation water turned on back home, it was up to us to get the manure out of the trailer, and with no water, we gotta put the shovels to work. One deck down, three to go. There can be a lot of manure that builds up over several loads of sheep, and this one was definitely ready for a cleaning. So one scoop at a time, out the side door goes all that good fertilizer, and along with it, a whole lot of unneeded weight. Got it all cleaned out, tired out, out of shape. But we're cleaned out, ready to go. Fire up trucks, get us a drink, head out of here and head for home. It's been a good day. Trucks cleaned out, sheep unloaded where they need to be for the winter. We're gonna head home. It's about three and a half hours to get there. And uh, it's been a pretty successful trip to the desert screws for home. It ain't always trucking, hauling, pretty sunsets and rainbows. Sometimes sheep come up missing, tires go flat and trailers need to be shoveled. But at the end of the day, it doesn't matter what it is that we're doing, it all makes for good days. Thanks for watching and joining us on our daily adventures. Be sure to subscribe to the channel for more desert shenanigans just like this.